Here is the second test for the 2014 Jeep Compass. We're still in the engine controller, and we're going to do another special test. I'm going to scroll down. This time we are going to do the set engine RPM test, the very bottom one. It's reminding us that the engine must be running. Temperature must be 180 degrees Fahrenheit. Transmission in park. So the car is running, we're in park. Let's verify where we're at for temperature. And we are at the 180 degrees or greater engine temperature. I am going to control the throttle by hitting increase. You see our command state went up to 900. And our idle RPM right here went to 900. We can look at um, some different parameters. We are in closed loop. We have our uh, engine coolant temperature and temperature amount. Go to page two here. We've got, hard to focus here. It, we've got our uh, O2 goal, some more O2 sensors. We can see we got good O2 activity. Page three, try that again, page three. Here we go. My fingers are a little bit dirty. We've got our O2 signals. Second uh, O2 volt um, sensor uh, voltage uh, information there. We'll go back to page two. Same information we were looking at. And back to page one for the data. We'll increase this a little bit more, go from 900 to 1000. If we wanted, we could go and look at the corresponding oxygen sensor signals on page two and three. So increase that up to 1100. Every time I increase the vehicle's powertrain control module, electronic control module, follows in kind. There's 1200. Everything looks good. Let's decrease. Back to 1100. Back to 1000. And we'll go ahead and stop the test. Puts us back to the idle RPM where it was supposed to be. And everything is good.